everyone. Today we are going to see the verb to be and how to use the verb to be in the future form, in the future tense. Okay. Now, we use helping verb will or shall along with be to form the future tense or the future form. Okay. Now, we are going to see how to use future form of to be in affirmative sentences, in negative sentences and in questions. How to make questions. Now, first, let's see the affirmative or the positive sentences. Like, first sentence, I will be hungry. Now, this shall be is used with first person singular I and first person plural we. Okay, like I shall be hungry, we shall be hungry. But even if we use will be, is no problem. Okay, so we can use will be with first person also. So I will be hungry, then second person you. You will be hungry. Then third person. He, she, it will be hungry. Then plural of first person. We. So, we shall be hungry is also correct. Or we will be hungry will do. Third person plural, they. They will be hungry. Okay. Now, this we can write in the contracted form. Like the first one. I will be hungry. We can write. I'll be hungry. Okay. So we have put apostrophe. I apostrophe and double L. So I'll be hungry. Same way. Second person. We write like this. You'll be hungry. Okay. Got it? Then she'll be hungry. He'll be hungry. It will be hungry. Got it? Then, we'll be hungry. We do it like this. And last one, we write like this. They, apostrophe, double L, they'll be hungry. Okay, got it? So, the contracted form of these sentences. Okay, you need to practice. So, keep on practicing. Okay, so affirmative form. Now, let's see the negative form. What you have to do is, in negative form, we have to make use of not. So, negative form. How to do it? I will not be hungry. So, from here we will change. This much we will rub it. Okay. So, I will not be hungry. Okay, so we have added not after will. I will not be hungry. You will not be hungry. He will not be hungry. She will not be hungry. It will not be hungry. Clear? Then we will not be hungry hungry. And last, they will 
not be hungry. Okay, now how to do the contracted form of these sentences? How to do it? Let's see. First sentence is I will not be hungry. How to contract it? Okay, now what we do? I will not becomes won't. Will not in the contracted form becomes won't. I won't be hungry. Okay. Similarly, you won't be hungry. Write it. Then, he won't be hungry. She won't be hungry. It won't be hungry. So, Got it? Then we won't be hungry. And last one, they won't be hungry. Okay, so the contracted form we write in this way. Now let's uh, form questions using the future form of to be. How to form questions using the verb to be in the future form? Okay. Now let's form question. Will I be hungry? Okay. First person. Same way with the second and the third person we are going to form question. Second person. Will you be hungry. You, second person. Okay. Third person. Will he be hungry? Same way. Will she be hungry? Will it be hungry? Got it? Then, plural of I, we. Will we be hungry? And third person plural, they, will they be hungry? Okay, now in the uh, negative also we can form questions like this. Will I not be hungry? Negative questions. Or you can use the contracted form. Won't I be hungry? Got it? Same way, we can write like this. Won't. Let's write in the contracted form. Won't you be hungry? Question mark. Won't he be hungry? Won't she be hungry? Then, won't we be hungry. Last, won't they be hungry? Question mark. Don't forget to put the question mark because they are all questions. Okay. So, I hope I have made it very clear. Hope you have understood how to use the verb to be to form the future tense. Any questions, please ask in the comment. Do like my video. See you in the next video. Have a nice day.